we will also come back another time. Asante sana. Thank you. Let me introduce the chairman of the Finance Committee of the National Assembly, a second term member of parliament for Molo, Kuria Kemani, Alias KK, a young man again, who drives our financial and economic agenda in parliament. Thank you very much, Your Excellency. I'll be very short. I was brought up by my grandparents. My mom was a single mom living in a rented house in Nakuru town. And when I finished, completed my high school, a day secondary school, and got an A minus, I knew that my life was doomed because there was no hope that despite me passing that while at university, there was nothing. We do a fundraise. I go to Kenyatta University to, to, to pursue a bachelor's degree in commerce. But I knew when I started the market that for you to make a name in the finance sector, you need to be a CPA, you need to be a certified public accountant. Went to KCA University, took the, what do you call it, the fee statement. And when I look at the figures, I knew it was impossible. I borrowed notes of the students who were studying there. By the time I was completing my undergraduate, I was a certified public accountant started off in the financial sector as a finance assistant and rose all the way to be the regional finance manager for Africa region for United States Catholic Foreign Mission Society. In 2017, at an age of 28, I attempted to run for member of parliament for Molo constituency and won with a landslide. For the last 30 years, Molo constituency had never re-elected anyone, but again, in 2022, I was re-elected as a member of parliament for the great people of Moala constituency. The belief of young leadership by His Excellency the President and His Excellency the Deputy President made me the chairperson, the Committee of Finance and National Planning at the National Assembly. Our job is to raise revenue for the government of Kenya, is to oversight institutions such as the Central Bank of Kenya, Kenya, uh, Kenya Revenue Authority, the National Treasury, State Department of Economic Planning, controller of budget, and oversee all laws pertaining to matters of insurance, pensions, bankings, microfinance, digital lenders, and all that physical space at the age now of 34. For that is proof that His Excellency the President and His Excellency the Deputy President believe in young people. Despite my very busy schedules, I've been able to complete my master's in international business management from Strathmore Business School, and now I just completed my coursework for my PhD at the University of Nairobi. <laughs> Learning never stops, continue to learn. When I left home to join first year at Kenyatta University, I knew I was not going back to Molo. I knew there was nothing to go back to. And when I went back, I went back driving my Prado, I went back supporting the community. I've sponsored thousands of students. I have people that I've educated who are now doctors, who are now teachers with my own money, even before I became a member of parliament. When God gives you a chance, because I know for sure that God will give you a chance to be a great person in this republic, please remember to give back to the society. Remember to hold someone else's hand because they will hold your hand tomorrow. Thank you very much and God bless you all. Thank you. Even as uh, we encourage you to be ambitious in leadership, I also want you to be ambitious in the relationships. I want to give you an opportunity.